The ceasefire in Syria appears to be holding since coming into effect Monday night, despite sporadic and minor violations. The UK-based Syrian Observatory for Human Rights said calm is prevailing in most of the country, though there were minor violations in Hama province. Another activist group reported some shelling in Aleppo. There will be challenges in the days of come, to come. We expect that. I expect that. I think everybody does. But despite that, this plan has a chance to work. We know that Russia has stood up with in the person of the foreign minister, Sergei Lavrov, and said that Assad has agreed to this plan. And they have obviously joined us in accepting responsibility for trying to put this into place. Syrian President Bashar al-Assad used the hours before the ceasefire was set to start to promise victory, indicating that this truce may only be temporary. Syria is determined to recover every area from terrorists, re-establishing safety and security. Heavy violence continued in Syria in the hours before the ceasefire started. If it holds for seven days, the U.S. and Russia will undertake a new collaboration of airstrikes against Islamic State and jihadist militants in Syria. We believe that uh, this is the only realistic and possible solution to this conflict, is ultimately a political outcome. I urge all the parties to support it, because it may be the last chance that one has to save a united Syria.